What's going on guys? We are here at the San Antonio River. We're gonna head down south to Espado Park and see what we can find as far as a few bass. Never done this trip, never done this uh, kayak stretch or anything like that, but uh, it is a first for us and we are excited to go I'm out here with my buddy David over here. So he's on the water, excited, couldn't wait, had to jump on and is uh, already searching out for some bass. We'll see what we can find out and hopefully we can find some uh, good bass, good sized bass and we'll see if we find a strange species to catch as well. Y'all stay tuned. Okay, so we were very optimistic on our trip. We thought we were gonna be catching a lot of fish, a lot of dinks, if, even if anything, but that wasn't the case. We came up to a, <laughs> what we thought was a halfway mark around South Cross and we didn't know how much further we had we actually launched around nine o'clock a.m and didn't get to south cross area until about five o'clock well we are in the fall transition and the uh days are getting shorter and that was not good we paddled to the paddled in the dark the rest of the way until we got to a spot apart at 7 p.m so we only caught a handful of fish really he caught two fish lost two fish and for me i only got that one bite it would felt good just to get even get a bite we thought we were going to catch a lot more but it just wasn't producing like we wanted to and we fished every single uh little drop or little spot uh very thoroughly but we figured anything from rock. south cross and beyond would be the best place to launch and to fish so if you do get a chance and you want to have a nice ride, start at uh, Roosevelt and work your way down. But if you want to fish, start at South Cross and work your way down to Espada. Okay, if this is your first time going down the uh, San Antonio River, it is uh, not too bad of a trip at all. But my recommendations as far as kayak is do not bring a Hobie. This Hobie that he brought got beat up. The rudder got pushed up. It is fun to paddle the river, but well, your kayak, depending on what it is, is going to get scratched up, beat up, torn up. And you're going to be hitting rocks, getting your kayak scraped on the sides. Uh, going down these chutes is not too bad at all but they aren't you are going to be hitting the bottom and it is going to scream up the kayak so if you have a transducer or anything that's exposed it is not the kayak to bring if you're thinking about bringing a pro angler i would not do that bring something that's going to be ready for the river easy to maneuver uh anything that's 10 foot would be ideal i have a 13 5 kayak it was okay but in some spots it was hard to maneuver. Um, there is a lot of shallow spots, uh, some that you do have to get out and drag your kayak over, but then you can get right back in, but there's nothing too dangerous about going. Uh, the average water depth that we found was probably about three no, feet to bad. four feet. And then there were some deep pools that were probably about eight feet. So it wasn't too bad at all. Keep it simple when going <laughs> to these rivers. If you're going, bring small little uh, right, I guess I'll go down conventional first. gear. And that was my mistake. <laughs> I brought big swim baits and uh, four inch crawfish, uh, yeah. but bring small little conventional uh, or or small little gear, crickets, worms, and that'll be ideal. Oh, it's cool. Coming out. 
Don't tell us. I didn't hear you, sorry. <laughs> What kind of crap is that? We'll be, we'll be out here until by 6 o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the other shoot? It's over there. Uh oh, shallow water. Shallow, shallow. This one has a little turn. And <laughs> Got a perfect track record. Oh. I'm stuck. Use your paddle to steer you. Get him on the worm. Get him on the worm. Watch your crankbait to the tree. Finally got one. Hell yeah. There you go. Now I'm gonna have to put him on the board. <laughs> oh, you're in the tournament, right? <laughs> I hit that rock. The struggle is real. <laughs> it's a fat one. Get your net. What are you doing? <laughs> 
Let's go! <laughs> no skunk! <laughs> Let's see it. A little fatty. Dude, that is healthy. <laughs> nice. I don't know.